Thank you, Tim. And we want to go back out live to Marty Bass. Yeah, we want to pick up right where we left off before some of those technical issues we were uh, experiencing. So please do continue, Marty. Well, we most certainly will. Dr. Iris Barnes, Cheryl Love, uh, head of the uh, museum and school here and head of the board of directors. So we were just talking about this display. Let's go ahead and pick up where we left off. So we have in the display a copy of the Emancipation Proclamation and General Granger's order number three. And he, was, he announced, he was the general for the Union Army, and he announced in Galveston, Texas, that slavery had ended, and that began Juneteenth. That was June 19, 1865. And that's, a, that's an original copy of the order. Mm -hmm. And in addition to those uh, documents, we also have someone's free papers. Um, and that was very important for when an individual was given their freedom, they had to have a document saying so. And they had to keep that document on them as they were moving about um, the town or the city. So, and, so, mm -hmm. so, and this is, how long will this be on display here? Oh, several months at least. So we have some shackles. We have one of the early books that would have been used in the classroom. Amazing, isn't it? By all the early teachers, our first teacher, Edmonia Highgate, who will join us later today. Yep. And uh, a replica of the desk. But we have the room set up as it would have looked as a classroom. Yeah, we are, we are in a classroom, which we'll show you more of coming up shortly. I'm just going to tell you this from my perspective. You stand here and you look at those shackles. Mm -hmm. And if you don't take a deep breath and pause for a moment, you have no soul. Mm -hmm. That's, that's just unbelievable. Mm -hmm. We're at the Hosanna uh, School and Museum in Harvard County. We're coming back next half hour. We've got some good stuff and some fun for you coming up. Yes, Ladies, thanks for hosting us. It's Thank you. Good. All right. Back at TV Hill. Thanks, Marty. Yeah, super compelling to see those historical tidbits right here in Maryland. In Harford County. Right. Who knew? Yes, yeah, so close mm -hmm. to us.